I'm not a morning person. I get up as late as I can when I'm not filming, that is. Stagger to the mirror and douse cold water in my face to start my day. And then I stare into the mirror to see what the damage is. To see what horrors the last 24 hours has wrought. <laughs> is this me? The real me? How could it be? It's a reflection, a trick of the light, a mirror image. It is the opposite of who I am. Me turned around with my part on the right instead of the left. My eyebrow ever so slightly raised, but it's the right, not the left. <laughs> and my lip uh, slanted upwards ever so slightly, but it's on the left and it should be the right. It's all back to front. It's not me. But it's the me I get to see every day. It's the me that's only one bathroom away. It's the me I use to create the me that everyone else will assume is me. But it isn't. Mirrors are just a big lie. Not only do they show you everything back to front, they lack depth. You only see what you want to see, what the mirror allows you to see. You, know, you, you never see the back of your head or the tag sticking out of your collar or that hole where a nail caught your t-shirt, you know. The mirror doesn't want you to see that. It wants you to see your best self back to front. In a way, it reminds me of what we're taught in biology. You know, about the idea about when an image enters the lens of your eye, it actually turns upside down so that when the image hits your retina in the back of the eye, it's upside down, and your brain has to learn how to turn it right side up. <laughs> That's one of the things you're dealing with when you're a newborn. You know, you're you're literally trying to understand a world that is upside down. Maybe this we're actually doing our whole lives, learning to navigate a world that isn't what it seems. You know, left is right, bad is good, black is white. Everything's up for grabs. And the only time you're you is when you're acting. Which seems like a contradiction. But not if you're doing it right. 